People around the world are protesting the Summer Olympics in Beijing. Good evening. I'm Karen Zaburis. Demonstrators worldwide say they're rallying for free Tibet, and they're upset over China's human rights record and the recent crackdown in Tibet. Here in the U.S., three protesters scaled one of the suspension cables of the Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco as part of an advanced protest to Monday's Olympic torch relay there. One of the protesters carried a Tibetan flag to tie to the bridge. California Highway Patrol arrested several people on the sidewalk near the protests. The Olympic torch is scheduled to make its way through the San Francisco streets on Wednesday. It's the only North American location hosting the relay. KZI 9 News reporter Dan Corcoran is live at the U of O outside Hayward Field this evening, home to the U.S. Olympic track trials this June. So, Dan, how are local Tibetans reacting to all of this? Well, Carenza, we are a world away from Tibet here in Lane County, but the violence and the oppression that takes place there is felt right here in those that call Tibet their home. <laughs> This local woman is begging for help. She fled from Tibet in 1959. Though she is a world away from her homeland, she says the wounds of persecution are still raw. And she prays that, you know, all beings find some peace and that, you know, the world community help to um, hear the voice what's, what's happening in Tibet. She is 65 years old, but was just 15 when she left her country. Her body is riddled with scars, including this one on her ankle, where she says a bullet from a Chinese-held weapon passed through her. And she's wondering when Tibet will have some peace and freedom, and that's what she's worried about. This woman's pleas are not alone. Around the world, in Tibet, Italy, the UK, France, and the US, Vigils and protests are following the Olympic torch, hoping to spark discussions between the Dalai Lama and the Chinese government and to shine the spotlight on China's entire record beyond the hosting of the 2008 Summer Olympic Games in Beijing. If it is a representation of peace and harmony, then it certainly is not happening in Tibet. Local Tibetans are not against the Olympic Games in China, but they are opposed to the torch traveling through Tibet's capital and Mount Everest. They're holding out hope for change because now the world is watching. That we hope that uh, the Chinese government will wake up and speak with His Holiness. And that's where our aspiration is and our prayers are. As you can see, a lot of emotion that surrounds what's going on in Tibet. The few Tibetan people that we spoke with tonight say they're planning a peaceful gathering right here at Hayward Field during the Olympic track trials to help spread the word about the oppression in their homeland. Live in Eugene, Dan Corcoran, KEZI 9 News. And 